hi guys and welcome to part and tutorial of a tip calculator this was sent to me by one of the viewers out there he wants me to write a program that will calculate the tips given to the restaurant by the customer yeah I guess you guys can see it the restaurant want to suggest a tip according to the service the Diana received there and um, he would like me to write a program that will calculate the tip according to Diana's satisfaction ask the Diana to enter the course of the meal ask the Diana to ask the Diana satisfaction level that will range from total satisfied that will be one and two is satisfied three is dissatisfied if the Diana is totally satisfied then that is one 20% of the cost of the meal satisfy 15% and 10% for dissatisfied report the satisfaction level tip and your solution should include the use of if and then a statement okay let's open up Python now I'm going to just minimize this and I would start by saying print because they will actually like us to print the following yeah there they are or there it is I might as well just copy and modify it copy all of that that would be the information that will be displayed and paste that there so that would be for number one if the customer is satisfied and then we'll close it up here there and dissatisfied or satisfied that's totally satisfied paste that there and paste this here as well and this is two we have three here so enter number one if he's satisfied and totally satisfied enter number two if he's just satisfied number three if he's dissatisfied so that is the first part of it taken care of so let's save this file save I'm just going to give that a name I'll call it T underscore control there we go and let's just click on save save that and it's save if I run this now this is what you guys will see there we go alright select one of the above now let's start by creating as follows cost let's say cost of meal of the meal or of meal cost of the meal so that's a variable there and this variable I'm going to say input enter the cost of the meal there now the next one enter the cost of the meal let's enter a bit of room in there my next variable will be is the customer satisfied so let's say input that would be satisfaction is a satisfaction level or satisfaction rating something like that okay rating there one that to be equals totally satisfied there we go that is it here totally satisfied That's the first condition or 
of the next of the first argument the second argument is satisfied so that is satisfied as the second argument and the third one that will be dissatisfied so number three that is dissatisfied so let's just grab this comma three dissatisfied and just run that up all right that is it all done okay now we have my we have my system by variables in place so let's do this now then the next thing we want to do now let's just open up that so that you guys can okay yeah you should be able to see it now the next thing is let's use an if statement is to check so let's come down here and we we'll say if satisfy no, let's get rid of this I should be just one T grab that if satisfy equals equals one so since it's string character I'm going to enter a quote there if satisfy equals equals one then create another variable the tape equals integer let's say int the cost of the mill okay cost of the mill we want to multiply that by 20 and divide by 100 so that is the very first one close that and let's let's close this here as well so totally satisfied I'll be 20 percent according to the according to the information on the exercise all right so in that case we just print out as a print that will be very satisfied something like that let's copy that or oh, satisfied very satisfied comma and we want you to calculate 20% well let's just enter percentage 20% tip and 20% tip let's say pound that will be equals we have to convert it back to string bill so the 20% tip that will be tip There we go. That's for twenty percent. Let's make sure it's all correct. Though. Right. I'm going to try the first one out. So let's run it and see. Hopefully, there shouldn't be any error. Okay. Let's try this out. But I would like you to let, let's just try it out and see. Number that would be the very first one. That is good. It's working. Let's say we're spending fifty-four pounds and satisfaction level is totally satisfied it's giving me 10 pounds that should give me more than that so let's change this to float and we change this to float as well so that we get the accurate value there we go and let's run it again we have to save it first and come in here enter exactly 54 pounds again press enter and level of satisfaction is one that's good 10 pounds 80p so that's very good so 
I'm just going to now copy this and change it around for the second part of it. So come right down here and let's paste. Paste the third one, the third condition. This is now 15 and this is going to be 10. Now here is number three and number two. That is it, all done. So we need to just change all of this. So this one will become satisfied and this one will become not satisfied. So this is three and this is two. There. Okay, and here that will be 15%. Why this one is 10%. There. Okay. And one other thing, we might as well enter pound sign there. There we go. And let's run it now. Run. There. In pound, let's say is about, it's just spent 90 pounds. And level of satisfaction is to, that is the amount of tips you get. Okay let's run it again one more time so have a good look at the lines of code guys run satisfaction level 70 80, uh, 78 pounds spent and satisfaction level this time around happens to be 3 not satisfied at all that is correct so with that guys i'm going to call it the end of this tutorial i suppose you guys enjoyed you all have a nice day now bye for now